So I thought I'd do something different here today. I thought I would uh, talk about the uh, why are there horseshoe players on uh, my train layout. And uh, you know apparently they're not running any trains on the uh, on the railway today. So I thought it would be a good time to uh, you know to uh, talk about this. You know it's nice and quiet here in the park. Um, you know disregarding the zombies of course. So um, basically uh, let me uh, let me start the story. So. Um, we used to live um, in, uh, in a little uh, town, uh, well, not that little town anymore, New Market. And uh, up there we had a really close-knit uh, group of neighbors. We lived on a court. And uh, all our kids were about the same age. They all grew up together. And um, they, uh, you know, it was a really nice, uh, nice thing there. But we uh, came to the point where we had to move on. I had to move closer to work. And... Uh, but, uh, you know, our, our neighbors, being the great people that they were, you know, they wanted to, to throw us up. Um, uh, what, what the? Ah, for pity's sakes. thought there weren't running any trains today. Oh, well. Uh, let's, uh, let's wait for it to pass so, you know, get a little uh, quieter here, you know. After all, it is a train layout. Longer train than I expected. Well, we can wait. We can wait. Okay. So let's see, where was oh, it? Yes, yes, I know where. Okay, yes, I was talking about. Yes, so we, uh, you know, we decided to leave, and our, our neighbors, you know, being all, you know, those great people that, that they are, and threw us a, a going away party. But let me back up a bit. So, the horseshoe pit, where the heck did that come from? Well, it's an interesting story, actually. So, uh, my next door neighbor, um, he, uh, he actually worked for a, a large uh, uh, company that owned golf courses and that. And he's also an avid horseshoe player. Well, wouldn't you know it, big golf uh, conglomeration. They got lots of really nice sand. What the heck? Is that, is that another? Oh, you got to be kidding me. Another train. Well, I don't know what's going on here. There wasn't supposed to be any trains around today. And this is the second one. Let me tell you. Well, let's enjoy this one a little more. Okay, so I think that train's in the clear. So let's hope things uh, stay a little quieter now. I'm having my doubts here now, though. So where was I again? Ah, oh, man, I'm losing track. All these interruptions. So, yeah. So, basically, uh, he got this uh, amazing sand, and he built these really, really good um, uh, horseshoe pits. And uh, it was really, uh, really amazing. You know, we had some really good games down there. It was right, like, kind of off our backyard. Hard to explain, but our backyard abutted onto another township. And so it was the perfect place. There's a farmer's field there, but there's a little tiny gap. And we were able to play uh, horseshoes there on a regular basis. It was a lot of fun, you know. And uh, so, you know. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Another. Oh, gee. Oh,
I don't think this many trains have ever gone through here in a day. What is going on? again right 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 yeah so we had this amazing horseshoe pits and we had a lot of really good times down there so um knowing that i had a great uh love for model trains and the fact that we had a lot of fun of the horseshoes um so what they uh, one of the things they gave uh gave uh to me it was um was this uh horseshoe set in hro scale so i thought well that's really cool so you know the challenge was on i was gonna have to incorporate this into my train layout somehow so when I was designing it, and I had this, uh, you know, part of the layout where the uh, track uh, comes through uh, Haynes, BC, which is uh, somewhere between um, Osoyoos and Penticton. Um, basically, I, I saw a spot where I could I could throw in like a little park here, and uh, and hence here here there here's the horseshoe players, and I even got some nice white sand, you know, made the little horseshoe pits and. Uh, Great. And then, uh, you know, just for a joke, you know, we never had any zombie issues up in Newmarket, but you never know. And uh, so there they are as well. So um, anyway, thank goodness, you know, uh, it seems that uh, things have quieted down here, finding the train layout. And I was able to, you know, finally tell my story. But gee, there's a heck of a lot of interruptions, you know, just just crazy. You know, I, I, I really don't know where all these trains come. Oh, you've got to be kidding what the heck oh anyway uh that's the story of the horseshoe players thank you for watching this video if you like what you saw and wish to see more content on model trains and real trains please subscribe to my channel